Niels Ebesen. Niels Ebesen, 1308-21, November 1340, was a Danish squire and national hero, known for his killing of Gerhard Roman III, Count of Holstein Rendsburg, in 1340. From 1332 to 1340, Count Gerhard was the lord of both Jutland and Funen. His death meant the end of Holstein rule in Denmark. Biography Little is known of Ebesen's background. He seems to have belonged to the Jutland gentry. Like many other of his class, he probably supported the Holstein occupiers during the years of chaos, but later turned against them, and when Count Gerhardt campaigned in Jutland in 1340, Ebesen supported the Jutland guerrillas. On 1 April 1340, Abesson and 47 of his warriors entered Randers and hid until nightfall. They got into the Count's headquarters and entered his bedroom. They cut off the Count's head over the end of the bed. Not wishing the act to be secret, Abesson's men beat a drum and shouted that the Count had been executed. When the Holsteiners gave chase, Abesson and his men fled toward the bridge over the river Guden. Sven Trost, one of Ebesen's men, had weakened the bridge, and as soon as Ebesen and his followers had crossed, they pulled the bridge down and made their escape, losing just a single man. During the following rebellion, Niels Ebesen played a main role in the resistance, but he was killed the same year during a fight against the Germans. Two thousand Danes laid siege to Skanderborg Castle in April 1340. A relief force of 600 German knights and a simultaneous attack from the castle drove the Danes back into their wagon fortress on Nun Hill. The ring of wagons was breached, and Ebesen and his men were surrounded and butchered by the Germans. Legacy Traditionally, Niels Ebesen has been regarded one of the great heroes of medieval Danish history and one of the symbols of Danish nationality. His actions marked the beginning of the liberation of Denmark. Yet others disapproved of his act, regarding it as simply murder. Whether his motives were purely national or partly private is impossible to know. This has not prevented both romantic Danish poetry and modern ballads from praising him as a freedom fighter. A memorial to Niels Ebesen and his followers was first erected in 1878 at Skanderborg. The Vispa Cross of Stone with a Bronze Sword was designed by the sculptor Louis Hasselrieis 1844-1912. A statue of Niels Ebesen was erected in 1882 at Randers. It was designed by the sculptor Ferdinand Edvard Ring 1829-1886. In 1942, during the German occupation of Denmark in the Second World War, a play about Ebesen's rebellion was written by the dramatist Kaj Monk, 1898-1944. The Nazi occupiers banned the play and murdered its playwright. A ballad DG F-156, Niels Ebesen dealing with the killing of Count Gerhardt, by Ebesen was translated into English in Alexander Gray's Historical Ballads of Denmark, Edinburgh University Press, 1958. Other sources. Dansk Biographisk Lexicon, Vol. 4, Köppen. 1980. Politikens Danmarksche Story, Vol. 4, by Erik Kiersgaard, Köppen. 1962. Jisk Kronik, Transel. By Rick Agnet Olsen. Arhis, 1995.